Bill Gowdy checking in. I got a little uh, problem with batteries. <laughs> it's uh, uh, my charge controller uh, kicked out the load. Uh, it's a Sunsaver 6 and a uh, little red light come on. I uh, checked my battery voltage and I'm down to 11.8 uh, volts. So uh, I haven't had enough sunshine. Uh, and with one 20 watt panel, I, I have finally, uh, I, one other time I had this happen. And uh, again, it was when I went a week without sunshine. And uh, you can see right now how overcast and gloomy it is. It's been this way for quite some time. Well, it shows charging, but it's not charging enough to keep up with my consumption. So I'm gonna have to, you know, eventually get uh, additional panels. So now what I'm going to have to do is start the generator and charge those batteries, get those batteries back up. And I, I hate to do that, but I don't have any other choice. So uh, that's what I'm going to do. I'll put the charge it up with the generator and uh, hopefully uh, we'll get some sunshine. Although they're, uh, they're saying that we're going to have some I don't know, two to four inches of snow and some sub-zero weather this next week. So I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> the adventure continues. So there's a Sun Saver 6. You can see the red LED load disconnect. Alright, so there's the voltage of my battery, 11.38. And that is with the, the charge controller on. And uh, with what with, with the solar panel connected right now and, uh, it just not not enough sunlight to charge those batteries to keep those batteries up it is so calm and so still in kind of a drizzly wet very humid damp conditions even a wind generator wouldn't generate me any power today so this is my Coleman PowerMate Max, my smallest of the, all the generators that I have, but it'll do the job that I need. It has a port here, let's see, right there, 12 volt 15 amp automatic reset DC battery charger. And I also have my 120 volt. And uh, Let's see here, got her on run. That turn, turn the fuel on. Let's see, got it on choke. 